35-year-old Christine Son and her husband Eric met in eighth grade science class. The middle school sweethearts are now partners in life and as church volunteers rehabbing homes after natural disasters. We'll go in and uh, work on those trees with the chainsaws. But for more than 10 years, Christine often felt fatigue or pain in her side and back. Then two years ago, new symptoms that were even more troubling. For about six months, I was experiencing blood in the urine. By the time blood in the urine became an issue, we had already dealt with so many other things that it was one of those, okay, well now we have a clue that we could start looking towards. Christine was referred to vascular surgeon Curtis Kim. Dr. Kim diagnosed Christine with nutcracker syndrome, a condition where abdominal arteries squeeze the vein leading to the kidneys. So you could imagine the nutcracker being cracked like this, where the renal vein gets really gets compressed here. To relieve the pressure, Dr. Kim threaded a small tube through a catheter into Christine's abdomen to perform what's called endovascular stenting. A stent or graft that goes outside of the vein so that the compression, whatever, whatever is compressing it, is lifted up. It was very, very painless, very minimal. In fact, just eight weeks later, Christine and Eric were once again teamed up on rooftops, partners in sickness and in health. I'm Marty Salt reporting.